Well, I've got pants. That's an improvement, right? Hardleg and his friends, they're gonna play a lot of games. It's Legs Play. And welcome back to Legs Play. Hardleg Joe here once again with Aimless James. I've got pants. Check them out. Pantsless man, now. Or pants, pants full. Pants full man. Pants leg. We're going back to, uh... Where were we again? The <laughs> demon, demons? Can I teleport to the demons? I can't teleport to the demons, can I? Nope. You gotta go back to the sister. Well, um, and that was in the Chasm of Abyss, right? No. No. That was in the... Daughter of Chaos. These None of these names make any sense. Yeah, that makes sense. How was, how was a place called the Daughter of Chaos? Because that's her. She is a Daughter of Chaos, and she owns that bonfire. And she named it after herself? No, you named, it, you named it after her because she can't speak. Jerk, making fun of handicapped people. Hey, you know. She would, is a kind and fair lady. I would never say. If you feed her humanity, she can recover herself to stop being so sickly. Never say bad things about illiterate people. You write them. Oh. <laughs> oh. I forget who said that joke, but it's always been one of my favorite jokes. I don't know what the equivalent would be for mute people. How do you insult mute people without them knowing? I guess you... No, because being mute doesn't lower your senses in any way, does it? It, it lowers your ability to noise. I mean, I guess With you... your mouth. Mouth noises, if yeah. you will. And I guess it doesn't really matter at the end of the day. It's not like they can say anything back to you. Although they pr probably hit you still. Probably stab you. Most people don't want to be hit. That giant Comment dome... Comment in the comments if you, you're into being hit. See that giant dome there? To the left? That one? Yeah, that's uh, Isolith right there. Neat. This Giant city. Also, the demon ruins are all there on the on the walls, as you were looking up there. Is, is that where I'm going, the Isolith? Yeah. Oh, okay. All that stuff up there, though, is part of the ruins that you came down in, so that's kind of neat. That would be neat, I would say. It's pretty are, are, neat. Are we doing um, Aimless James Trivia Part 2? Are we? The Legend of Lane, Aimless James? I thought we were playing as Lonk. No. It's no. Lonk. It's like Link, but like super budget. But with fundamental differences. Budget differences. Budget differences. Why you gotta hit so hard? You could black flame him. Make him tickle. I don't like this guy. Damn it, that was how much I just healed. We'll stop healing in front of him and maybe he wouldn't do it. There we go. Nerd. That's what you get for wearing a cow. Cows just like... are a proud and noble species, all right. They're not. <laughs> They're not at all. They've been domesticated so long. They're like chickens. Chickens have been domesticated so long that, like, there are no more wild chickens. No one. There was not a time when people remember what wild chickens looked like. They're crazy. Yep. And I pretty much just have to pay, pay the health toll. Go down here. It's fine, there's a campfire. Just be like, hello. We could sing, we could sing the campfire song song. Do no. you know that song? No, we, we don't know that song. Nope, no. Are you a... No, some of them are actually just statues. Other <laughs> ones are assholes. Great, so they made statues of the stone things that attack you. Yep. Why would they celebrate those? Well, because some of them are demons. That have uh, possessed them in some way, I think. I don't know. Don't explain that very much. Yeah, what? there's not much lore on these weird demon statue dudes. It's not. I'm kind of confused in general where demons fall into the like. I get there are humans and there are undead and there are dragons, but where do demons fall into things? Demons come from the final boss of this area. Oh, okay. All of them? Yep. So if I... They were literally birthed when the Witch of Isolith tried to recreate the first flame by using her, the, uh, the Lord's Soul to make a new flame. Oh, okay. And when she did it, she uh, technically created life, except it was the demons. And then John was the demons? Jean-Claude Van Damme? Okay, good. That non-roll worked out for me. What? Is he, he like, step he on you. me? Well, he is on an upward angle, so maybe he just stepped on you. Yep, maybe. I need to uh, roll away from him. Okay. 
Let's just drink. Let's just get some delicious Sunny D on this situation. Maybe if you'd stop sucking. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow, my pride, James. <laughs> what hit me? Oh. Here's your... another, another one. one. What the fuck? That guy just drops one every single time for me. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you just... Nice. Nice. <laughs> Nice. That was nice. Oh, yeah, we should mention we were looking up things. This is the. This is like. Oh come on, man. Leave me I alone. just. I just run. Cause he's a slow walker. Yeah, but I gotta fight these things. They take three hits. It's fine. They won't. He, he doesn't follow me up here, does he? Yeah. Fuck. Go faster. Okay. Okay, he's back. Okay, he's back and down. Okay, so you got two options. Um, fog door, or go to the right of the fog door. Well, there was that capper demon over there by a thing. Uh, yeah, it's just a soul item. I like soul items, James. And capper demons ain't shit to me, alright? Alright, we'll go uh, um, teach him the meaning of the word haste. Will do. But yeah, this is, this is almost two years. I think it was July 2015 when we started this. Like... Bloodborne Whoa. was out, and we were making jokes about playing Dark Souls 3. Wow, that just fucking wrecks him. If I can cast it. Sneeze. Come on. Come on. Stop drinking so much, God. Okay. No, it's okay. <laughs> Sneeze. There we go. No, that's fine. That went better than I thought. I should've just fought him normally. I would've had just as much. Yeah, we just have to comment the, the fact that people are still here watching this. Two years later, who would've thunk it? One of our most popular series. It was like the first thing that you ever you ever recorded with us too, I believe, other than uh... No, there was another thing. There was you have to beat the game. Yeah. Or you have to win the game. You have to win the game. Um, I do like shinies. That's, that's where I had to I had to have my Brandon training wheels. Yeah. Um You gotta actually like jump to that. Comment on the comments if you think I could do it. Hashtag fail. Hey! I did it! Yay, everyone who believed in me, you you believed in me. You didn't um, hashtag fail enough, guys. What the hell? Soul of a brave warrior. I wanna jump onto that tree? Climb down? You could, but what if there's something at the other end of this? Like a boss? There could be another item. I do or like, I do like items. Just uh just an idea there could also be massive disappointment. Oh. Oh. Uh, That's a gift of the reward in its own right, right? Er, er, right. I guess it's better than like, you know, a giant slug thing could have came out of the wall as I was running down another corridor. Just to like knock you off. Yeah. Plum it to the ground and die. Um, All right, hashtag believe 2.0. Oh, great. Um, I think I can just walk off this one. Hey, that barely hurt at all. I gotta go up there and walk all the way down that way. Um, I don't like long, spooky corridors, James. They kind of creep me out. No, it's fine. There's just you know, a bunch of. Uh, how, how are trees growing down here? This is one tree. And it's immune to being chopped, but not to being rolled through. But only that one part. No, that part's dead. It's fine. Oh, these, okay. These parts are all dead. Ha! Take that, world tree. Teach you to grow in my neighborhood. Yes. Yeah, trees like, get out. Trees like get out. out. <laughs> we'll, let him, let it, we'll let him get his anger out on this fucking tree and right this now. Is, this is when you find out that hard leg is racist against trees. <laughs> Can you be racist against trees? You can be after playing this game. <laughs> Damn ants. Oh, oh, hey, look! It's uh, sunlight maggots. Oh, hey. Kill it. Oh, hey, they die easily. Yep, these things are part of a que uh, quest, but... Uh, Not you anymore! You haven't been doing the questy thingy, so... You can't open that door. Then why did I come down here? Locked by some uh, contraption. Well, I'm glad I wasted my time. 
If you're doing, like, Solaire's entire quest, eventually there is a thing down here that you have to kill, otherwise he goes psycho. Oh. Solaire's the praise of the sun guy, right? Yep. I didn't even know you could do quests for NPCs in this game. Every NPC that you can summon has a quest. Huh. Also, some that you can't summon have quests. I guess fog wall, here I come. Oh, I wonder if it's a boss. Yeah, because you pointed out that boss over there. Yeah, but that's not the same boss. Oh. This is just one of these guys, it's the same dude you've been fighting. You remember him, right? Uh, no. It's the Asylum Demon, but he's on fire. Also, his stick is much longer. Yeah, I couldn't I couldn't roll, roll around. Can I just run past this? Nope. But the game teaches me to run past things, James. Yeah, until you hit a fog wall and it's Mega Man style. You gotta go through the fog wall, fight the thing. Oh, great. So how about with the Fire Sage? Um, I believe, uh, according to lore, he's actually the first demon. Ah. And I'm guessing his weakness is fire. Nope. In fact, he's borderline immune to it. Borderline immune to it, but not completely immune to it. Immune enough to it that there'd be no fucking point in trying. I've learned well. Run, run, run. Although I don't know what Black Flame would do for the two of them, because Black Flame's in a in abyssal pyromancy. It's a different. It's a it's, different a, thing. it's darkness. Yep. It's dark fire. You're not, you're not getting them uh, them them rolly timey times down, or them giddy uppy rolly times down. Yeah, I didn't even I didn't even have a chance to get up completely. You were up uh, completely. You, just didn't you gotta roll into the swings. Into the swings. Otherwise, the iframes are just gonna follow you. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, James. It's too technical. Just roll into his swing. <laughs> okay. Because the way the iframes work on your rolls is if you roll the same direction that they swing, you literally come out of your roll while still stuck inside their sword. Huh. More aimless James trivia. This time on the background of the game. On the behind the scenes stuff. What's up, guys? You suck at your job. Some buffoons just running past you. Imagine if you could get in the White House this way. I think some guy you, did once, actually. I don't think about it. You just get political. <laughs> he threw out an explosion. Oh, did he? Now he's doing his butt bomb. How do you not remember this guy? You fought as the first boss you ever fought. Um, I don't... <laughs> I don't remember actually uh, fighting him. I mostly uh, plunged attacked him. And then just swang wildly. And he didn't quite hit so hard. Yeah, he did. He had like five health before. <laughs> now you've got level 60 health. Hmm. Last he time, I don't remember him killing me in two balls. hits. It took like four hits. Yep. Whoa. I mean, you are like sort of just running right in there, getting smacked in the face by a giant axe. I mean, he's really big. Get buddy butt bomb, and you just kept swinging it. Is not there anymore, butt bomb. I thought it was just a trick of the camera. Like I didn't think he'd actually it <laughs> up. <into the laughs> it air. flew up in the air. I didn't think he'd actually come down, sit on me. He's he's been watching Smo too much. See so if you can just bait him to constantly do that. See if he did it again. He was yeah. in the air. I would. Yeah, but uh, the way he. He has a really big axe. He does. I guess I gotta stand next to him. How is this harder than the Four Kings? He's just some big fat fuck. Cause you're playing it wrong. <laughs> Four Kings you can be aggressive with. This one I'm not really sure what your strategy is. So far you've run at him and then swung at the air under his butt. Oh, you're trying yeah. to waft the farts away. <laughs> It, I've run at him and then I've been confused by perspective. I mean, you just not lock on. But every time you always tell me to lock on. It's because every time I say to lock on, it's because you're on a boss that you need to lock on. Well, this guy I don't need to lock on. No, he's big and huge. You're not going to lose sight of him. I might. I mean, don't you underestimate <laughs> Don't underestimate my abilities. Wow, two swings bled him. 
Oh, you're in trouble. I am. Oh, that didn't actually do that much damage. It's fine. Oh, good. So if you can stay next to his butt, you can sort of trick him into doing that. Holy crap. Okay. Yeah, he'll just keep doing the slam. Jesus, it's two swings makes him bleed. Well, I mean, to be fair, with, with, a, with an actual sword, I'd probably start bleeding after one. No, definitely not. Because uh, most regular swords don't have bleed. <laughs> no, I mean like in, a, in real life. Like a real life sword, if you stab me with it, I'd probably start bleeding right away. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, yeah, he hey. got his weapon, so that's cool. What, what does it do? No, the fog wall's gone. Now things can chase me in here. <laughs> Great. Let me just get back those zero souls. Actually, I think they. I don't think enemies go into the boss wall, the uh, boss rooms. Oh, okay. Man, I've got a lot of timbering to do. <laughs> I'll have to come back here later off camera and make sure I cut all these down, especially this one. Yeah, oh, hey, this one actually can be hit. Does that mean eventually I can chop it down? Nope. You can bounce off of it until your weapon breaks. Unrealistic. You can bounce off of it until your weapon breaks. Unrealistic. You can open a shortcut if you go down there. I don't believe you. That sounds like something you would say if you wanted me to jump off the cliff. But there's no cliff, it's just stairs. Is it? What are you shooting at? He's oh, confused. it is just stairs. Okay. It's stairs that lead to the abyss! <laughs> oh, oh wait, where? the the shortcut's up, actually, I just realized. Oh, Down there a... is literally another boss. But there's a bonfire. Yeah, you can like that. And I'll get my Estus back, and then those guys will come back that I just killed. It, um, they're so easy, though. I could probably level up, too. You nope. could not. I need a lot of souls to level up at this point. Jumping upstairs, I wouldn't recommend it in real life. Yeah, definitely not, especially rolling on them. Yep. Hey, guys. <laughs> I bled them, it's okay. They don't they, drop anything. They don't me. take bleed damage. Shh. They're stone, you can't. You can't no bleed. tears. Only bleed. <laughs> I got two shot again with two handed. Yeah. You should have been two handing the whole time. I wasn't? Nope. I keep hoping they'll drop something, like a Titanite chunk or something. But no. They're just dumb things. <laughs> Didn't stand a chance. Oh, that one stood a chance! <laughs> he stood so much chance, James! I was wondering why you stopped swinging, because you only hit him once. I thought I hit all <laughs> of them twice. Eh. Fuck these trees. <laughs> I wonder who commissioned those statues. What sort of demon craftsman made them? Um, this looks ominous. Uh oh. An elevator -y. A fiery elevator. Fire Vader. Hey, look where we're at. Hey, how did this get down? I thought it was up when I went through here. It was. Huh. Did See, now you have a warp point to go to. So when you, if you need to go somewhere else, you can just warp to here, and then just take the elevator down instead of having to go through the whole ruin again. Yep. And also, I can get ten Estus. Huzzah. Yep. How come this is a fiery, uh, thing? A what, fireplace? Th this is the fire temple? <laughs> it's the demon ruins. Oops. Yeah, that's a hole you don't want to fall in. Well, I guess I'm going this- oh. I guess you're not. <laughs> um... <laughs> Just sneak don't, the corner. Do I want to go that way? No, that looks equally not-, not this, is the, this is the way you came in. Is it? Doesn't look like it. No, it is. Look down. Doesn't that room look familiar? Oh. There used to be stairs to get up there, and then that asshole down there broke them. That <laughs> asshole. Um. Oh, hey, it came back. Good. The very next day, like the cat. I guess I might as well double check and make sure this isn't as empty as I thought. Okay. What's the point of that part, even? Even. Maybe it never got completed. Maybe. Maybe they somebody stopped, else broke it. They stopped building things. These guys don't stand a chance. There we go. 
Now that we have actually hit them. <laughs> this time, 900 souls. All I gotta do is a couple thousand more times and I'm set. Ah! Damn it! <laughs> and then you swing the wrong way. I hit the wall. I'll teach that wall. Then you just run into the fire. Great. So much for getting 10 Estus. Okay. <laughs> Death and destruction to all. Donate to my Patreon. <laughs> Help support my ability to bring death and destruction to all. A donation of just one dollar gets you a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh related things that has nothing to do with the Let's Plays. But very, very few people um, watch the, the Let's Plays and not the Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, so, you know, I'm good with that. Cool. I don't know why, but that reminded me of that. Uh, it was like an episode of Metalocalypse where they were trying to they were trying to find a religion to follow, and eventually they got to Satanism. That was a good episode. The, the Satan Church is literally just them like having like a group meeting. It's just like whoever has the black sedan outside, you left your lights on. Hail, Hail Satan! Satan. <laughs> like the, what was it? They went to they went to a. Uh... They went to a, an actual like Christian church. They went to a atheist church, which was which was uh, uh, hilarious because they were like praying to not God. They were like, <laughs> "Dear God, that we don't believe in." And then they got attacked by agnostics because apparently the atheists and the agnostics have a huge rivalry. But uh, yeah, the 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 funny. And then they went to the Satanist church. But every church was uh, exactly the same church, just reskinned. Yep. <laughs> and uh, I've died. Oh. No, it's okay. This is Dark Souls 1. You can actually fall. <laughs> Dark Souls 2, you would have died like, you know, 20 feet higher than that. A million times over. Was there anything I missed on the way there? I don't think so. It just snaked down, right? Now it's time to go through a bigger fog wall and fight another boss. Hey, remember that giant centipede bitch? Yep. Oh, hey, a cinematic. I could maybe make a thumbnail out of this. If you're wondering where the thumbnail came from, probably part of this. Now you can fight it. And it's way angrier. Why is it so angry? Why can't I just talk my way out of one boss fight? <laughs> also, that's not a centipede. Hey. I don't know what kind of centipede you've seen, but they don't look like that. This is a centipede, or rather, a bunch of centipedes. Fucked up and mouthed together. It's a multi-centipede. Multipede. It's even called a centipede demon. Oh, wow. Alright, have fun. Touching lava will kill you. Instantly? In like a, a half a second. <laughs> uh... It burns this. There has to be a way to get to, uh... Well, you touched it and took, like, the entire bar of health. I wonder what t touching it like five times would do. Good question. Aha, I rolled. And I still took damage. <laughs> I took damage jumping over the lava. Great. It's it's really hot lava. Yeah. To be fair, that's in real life I would probably be dead even this close to lava. Um excuse, I'm trying to find a place where I could fight you uh on fairly fair. Oh, there is a nice, uh, nice little uh, spot over here. You gotta go around this little, uh, this little wall here, and you get a nice big open area to fight him in. Full of lava. Oh, probably should have sprinted across that. I'm just gonna take a nice leisurely lava stroll. Hey, look, useless green tide night shard. That's cool. Oh, hey, they're just pouring lava down here onto that guy. So this is, this is nice. I like it over here. Um, you think he's weak to fire? You know, something <laughs> tells me he probably doesn't give a shit. Probably not. I, I'd say locking onto him is a bad idea. Okay. I almost hit him. Yeah, I had no idea where that attack was going. He's got a lot of different uh, parts that are all wiggling around. This is truly one of the camera battles. Yeah. You got that one. That didn't hit me. Okay, I found his feet. Roll. Okay. 
Attack his thighs! This is just like when I'm fi fighting chicken sandwiches. Um, you attack the thigh? Yep. I don't think he knows I'm back here. Oh, hey. So, yeah, when you cut his parts, the, uh... Oh, cool, so you got a uh, very important ring. Oh, he's not dead yet. Nope. Now kill him. There we go. But, yeah, every single one of those centipedes you can actually cut off and they become other enemies. Oh. Uh. So, going for the feet was actually probably the smartest thing you did. Yay! Also, that ring you got is beautiful. And I got a homeward bone. I would throw that ring on immediately. Uh, let's see, what kind of ring do I got here? I want to take that one off because it breaks. Uh, it was the orange something ring, right? Orange charred ring. Reduces lava damage. And we get a lower bit. Um, since his sores were inflamed by lava from birth, they gave him a special ring. He readily dropped it, and from that spot a centipede demon was born. So, ceaseless Discharge had that, and it was supposed to keep the lava from hurting him. Oh, okay. And the dipshit just dropped it. But, so because it... of that, the lava now does minimal damage to you. But it still does damage. Yeah, but I mean, like, running it. It's like, it, like, oh, okay. tickles now. <laughs> is that something that's interesting? Like, something I need to get, or is it just No, a... it's just there. Okay. It's just neat. It's just a cool little thing. It's just a thing that's there. There's a door there. That's neat. Yeah. There was a fog door over there that I couldn't get through. Just kidding, it's a rock wall. It wishes it was a door. What a dick. Damn it. Maybe you should go where that fog gate was. Yeah. Since you know <laughs> fire just tickles now. <laughs> I just put on this ring and now my legs are just fire. Is there something over here? Fire. A slightly more inconvenient spot to fight him. <laughs> <laughs> An even more inconvenient spot. I think, was that the first boss I beat on my first try? Um, have I beat any there was other boss else. as easily? I could have sworn there was something else. It iron started did, off really I bad, mean, too. There was the Iron Golem, but that doesn't count, because Tarkus did it for you. <laughs> yeah. That's that was the, a Tarkus fight. Oh, hey, yeah, look, it's our buddy. One second. Bonfire first. And then it brings the centipede demon back. <laughs> you can level up, too. Oh, can I? Okay, one moment, guy. I'll talk to you in a moment. It's your buddy, your friend, Solaire Man. I want to do attunement? I forget what... Well, do you really need attunement, though? I forget what we were doing. <laughs> Already. Again. Uh, you can raise dexterity, it'll make your sword do more damage. You can get more health, get more stamina, so you can do more swingy swings. I think stamina is what I need. So let's do endurance, then. Yeah, because that was 23, so we probably want to get it up to 25 like everything else. Yeah, let's put that 25. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. More swings. What's up, buddy? Why? Why? Because. After all this searching, I still cannot find it. What you trying to find, buddy? He said I told you when you first met him. He's been Why? trying to find his own son. Oh. He praises the son so much that he wants one for his very own. Ah. Oh. But he cannot find it. Does he want, like, a, a literal, like, fiery-in-the-sky sun? Or, like, a, uh... Yeah, uh, he'll find one eventually, uh, uh, but probably not for the good. The or, good or, like, an S-O-N, like, I need to get a... I need to adopt a kid's son. Nope, he, he wants a literal sun-in-the-sky sun. A light source that creates life. But... Praise it. 460, praise it. Is, is, <laughs> isn't uh, one son enough? Like, why do we need more? Oh, hey, we're well, lost Isolith. No, he wants his own son. Huh, greedy. I'm, I, I'm glad I didn't help him. There's a very interesting line of things just sort of standing out there. I don't know if you've noticed. Oh, those are things. I thought that was just, like, more... Yeah, see, the monsters look so much like roots. I thought those were just, uh, you know... I didn't know they were animate, living, non-living beings. This tree's an animate, non-living being. True. Are those dinosaurs? Uh, they're half of bodies. Huh. You've seen the other half of those. Have I? Is those that half of a dragon laying on the side of the cliff that just starts puking poison all over the place? Um, he's one of those, except that's his lower half right there. Huh. 
I, I don't suppose it's helpless and I could kill it here and then I wouldn't have to worry about it elsewhere. Um, nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope, the world isn't fair like that. So they're the giant centipede things? Nope. Oh. They're just the, they're just the butt half of uh of uh dragons. Huh. I'm not quite sure what you're talking about then. Oh it's yeah, like, they're just We're going to like the Valley of the Drakes and there was that one dragon just hanging off the side of the cliff and it wouldn't move until you tried to take one of the items from it. Uh don't think I've done that yet, James. You have done this. I don't remember. Hey. <sighs> It's it's, it's, it's been, fine. It it's was like been a long it's two okay. Years. It was two years ago. <laughs> yeah. Uh, where do I fucking go? Into the lava. But it's spooky there. There's another branch you can go to right there. This one. Yeah. Oh okay. I'm having trouble with perspective. Everything's so bright and red and glowy. It's one of the few mods I try to get on PC for this game. Is the one that makes the fucking glow go away. <laughs> Less glowy Dark Souls. Let's just let. I think it's literally called less glowy lava. <laughs> Make Dark Souls dark again. What's this? Oh. A free thing. So as long as you stay like on, you know, near the buildings and away from those things, though they shouldn't attack you. They can attack me. They can. They will. Ah. And they raffle stomp. They they probably literally stomp since that's all they can do as butts. Yep. Um. Open door. Nope. Nope. No happiness here. Nope. I gotta Didn't be you hear sure. Me? I said no happiness here. Uh, There's a chest. But is it a trustworthy chest? It could be. I don't see the chain. The chain is going away from me, so it's safe. Yay. A great hero. The best soul item. He's the best around. Soul of a great hero will give you 20,000 souls. That's more than I have now. Oh, this one. Ah! You can't get me over here, right? Oh, it can. It's mad. It's gonna chase you now. You should probably just run. <laughs> Look at that tree. You can get higher than it. I don't know where to go. I'm just running for my life. Don't the run. camera controls are hard to control because <laughs> I'm running for my life and I run. There you go. Now you're higher than him, so he shouldn't be able to get you. Haha, ha, you're just a butt. <laughs> Literally. Literally. <laughs> you're such a butt. Twin humanities. Double the pleasure, so we're gonna, double the fun. We're going to find a uh, secret bonfire. Secret bonfire? Is it here? <laughs> no. What about right here? Yep, that that was it. <laughs> I need to go back uh, down, you, don't I? Yeah. Um, you could just YOLO jump. You got health. Ouch. Oh, that did so much damage. Ha! No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no! <laughs> it, made a so it made a flesh sound instead of a stone sound. I had to double check. Is there no door into this one? There is. See, that one was real! Oh, you pissed off his buddy. It's okay, his buddy literally killed him. There we go. He said there was a way in here, so I'm assuming that one of these does the things. Aha! Aww. You can't get me in here because there's a bonfire. You could touch it and then they'll be like, no. My existence is futile. It's just like the Borg all over again. So your destination is straight out of that doorway. Right over to that. You see that, that, uh, that walkway that's now on the floor. Yep, that over there. Oh, okay. 
Yeah, this is like hurting my eyes. To <laughs> you have to comment in the <laughs> comments if this is like difficult for you to watch. It's difficult for, for me to watch for other reasons. Yeah. <laughs> for reasons other, for visual reasons, not because of my incompetence reasons. I mean, that could be a visual thing. <laughs> Your visual incompetence is triggering me. I can see how ugly I am, even without the face cams. You know, I don't think you can go through there. I, I'm not sure what's telling me that. It might be the incompetence thing. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little bit. Um, so on the upside, you don't need that ring anymore for the rest of this area. Just if you die or whatever. Well, uh, uh, let me rephrase that. When you die, um, you're going to need to put it back on. Okay. <laughs> also, um, roots. You should... <laughs> um, what'd you do? Um, I got stuck Sprint somehow. Sprint and jump. Sprint and jump. Different directions, maybe? How did you... Okay. okay. That was weird. Yes. The greatest foe in Dark Souls, other than the camera. That was gravity. And gravity. It's the world itself. The first time, it didn't make... <laughs> it made, like, flesh sounds. And it made me think that I was going to do things. And... Oh, I think you can hide from me there, Arya. Oh, I'll be coming after you with the old brimstone. Pretty soon I'll actually, be running past all these. Actually, I think he's more brimstone than you are. You know he's got fire and stuff. Yeah. Oh no, there's one right there. So if you don't get that secret bonfire, you're just sort of like... You have to run have to from run the beginning of the lava. Way. Going a long way. I don't trust any of these. Wait, is that a secret over there? Are there hiddens? Or maybe just another archway to go in? <laughs> yeah, I'm getting so much souls, I'm learning the experience. Take that, tree. No one cares about you or your loved ones. Just like me. Ouch. Yep. I made myself sad. <laughs> Where are you going? They just really don't stand a chance, do they? Yeah. It's like, nope, death comes. Oh. Except for that one. Who do you think you are, Reaper? Yep. Right. Dirk. Stun lock! I'm locking your stuns! Ah, oh, I didn't need to chop that one. Um, is this secret? Nope. No. I wonder how long it'll be before all the secrets are found. Wait, there's a secret? <gasps> found one. Secrets. It's on a guy wearing a thong. How lewd. I think that might have been a female body. I saw a bra on it. Guys can wear bras too. Not in this game. What is this? Oh. Giant spongy Cthulhu monster. Is it weak to fire? Okay. So, remember that thing where I was like, hey, you're about to go to the fireplace where all the chaos demons were born out of fire. Actually, that's really weird that it is very weak to... Now, what the fuck is it doing down here? I've never actually tried fire on that thing. <laughs> Why is that weak to fire? And it's literally, like... Maybe 200 feet away from the thing that created all fire demons. <laughs> it's like five feet away from the source of all fire. It's just where it lives. I mean, you know. That's just where he lives. Yeah. <laughs> the Sultan of Oman lives in Zanzibar now. I love that more than I should. I saw a glowy somewhere around here. There's got to be one of these paths that takes me to fuck you. Where is fuck you exactly? Exactly. There it is. It's down the twisty weeny whiny. Yep. Oh, well, now you're down there. Just like my love life. Twisty ah. weeny and whiny. Yep. You should see a doctor about that. I should. But I don't have much money. So we'll live a hero. I'm holding out for a hero. I'm holding out for a hero till the end of the night. 
don't have to wait very long. That is one of the hardest ones to get. Because uh, you're going to slide down that. Oh, oh you stay. Don't roll off now. Okay. A rare ring of sacrifice. Don't I already have one of those? Oh, you had a ring of sacrifice. Rare ring of sacrifice makes it so uh, you literally, like, retain everything when you die. Oh, okay. Which is mostly... You, you, and you also can't get cursed if you get cursed while wearing one. So it's one of those things that I want to save for just, like, specifically when I go up against a, a boss that can curse me. Yeah, but you already fought the boss that can curse you. Oh, there's only one? Yep. So is there any reason to wear it now other than just feeling better about yourself? Nope. Okay, so... Save it for when you're at a boss fog wall and you got, like... You know, 80,000 souls for some god knows why reason. Yep. If I just go straight from one boss into the other. Ooh, there's a lot of these things now. That's Better. kind of how this area has been. You sort of, I mean, you already done two bosses. Yep. And you're right next to the third one. The question is, will you find the boss first? Or the trap? There's a trap. It's our trap! But not yet. <laughs> But not yet, but there will be one. <laughs> Was that the trap? Probably. These things are just killed. Like, these things don't actually pose a threat. It's just my own incompetence. I'm just trying to rush and kill, kill them so quickly. But they're, like, so slow moving and easy to predict. I can't imagine they would be difficult to go through even if you had like a weaker weapon or a lower level. Yeah, you can stun lock them by punching them, I think. So. Just, yeah, you could poke them with a pillow and kill them pretty much. <laughs> I could poke them with my pillow. I don't like long hallways. They are ominous. This is there's a nice thing over here though. Oh hey. Does he look familiar? Um, is that a uh oh it's like a Titanite demon, right? Yep. Interesting thing about this guy. He can um, jump. He respawns. Great. And he hits harder than I thought. He hit twice. Yeah. And you did. I just assumed the jump did a whole lot of damage, and uh, the and swing he... wouldn't do nearly as much damage. Well, he jumped on you, and then he kind of sneezed on you. Yep. Speaking so... of sneezing. Hit! <laughs> Ugh! Pardon me. It'd probably help if I had my ring of, uh, save me from stuff. <laughs> ring of save me from stuff. Yes. Ring That's of steel I mean. save me from shit. The ring of the SSS. The ring of the fuck up boots. Well, right now you're wearing, like, the fuck it boots lava edition. Yeah. I like how the lava kind of sticks, or maybe that's just the light reflecting off of it. It's know. the light reflecting off your metal legs. Oh, uh, okay. I thought it was like lava was like sticking to the bottom. Okay. So now he has learned step one of all Dark Souls games. Ignore all enemies except for bosses. It's... <laughs> well, how am I going to get good if I don't fight? That's how you get good. You realize you don't have to fight. It's... I have to fight that thing. And then laugh at the fact that it's weak to its own existence. Yep. Okay, which way did I go? The only way I could go? Gotcha. Wait, did I go down? Yeah, you went down. Okay. There is an up, though. Up is always an option. I'll have to check that after I get my swords back. And uh, deal with the titanid nerve. Should I kill it to get the titan? I know, I can't even... Uh, right now, not anything useful, so there's not really a point. I mean, he keeps coming back, though, so I guess you can farm Titanite off of this guy? Yep. There's also a bonfire past him, if I believe correctly. I can't remember I where I dodged it is. that expertly. It's okay, you won't dodge that. Or this. <laughs> Chug-a-log. It's okay, you can't follow me once I get past here. He's like Ichabod Crane. I can't follow you across that river, lad. Hey. Oh.
I did it. He did it. A twinkling Titanite. I thought that was a... Um... Okay, so you might actually have a chance to save Solaire. Yay. By killing these? What have you done to Solaire? Uh, oh, nope. Never mind. He already found it. He fucked up. Whoa. I have. 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 What is this glowy thing? What is. I am so. I just wanted to grab the glowy thing and it wouldn't let me. Because he was talking and he's trying to fight you. <laughs> glowy That's thing you get... first, then fighting. But dialogue. You you just you just got like Wait, waffles. Did I? I thought I. Oh no, there is no. I was like, but what about the bonfire I sat at? It's like, oh wait, what bonfire? I sat at bonfire. There was no fire buns. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I couldn't remember the like the way you're supposed to do it is you have to get to that door and have that open already before Solaire comes down here. Oh okay. Is he gonna be back there? I assume. Yep. He's Just... officially gone hollow. One of those maggots is now attached to his head, and when you're wearing those things as a helmet, it provides a light for you. So he's taking that as that he finally found his own son. But it's literally, like, eating his mind and driving him insane. Huh. And he just attacks whatever? Yep. So now I can't summon him anymore? Nope. Did I ever summon him before? Yep. Once. <laughs> <laughs> one time. <laughs> this one time when I was finding these gargoyle motherfuckers. Would I want to summon him again ever? I like, mean, is, is this a, a. Oh no. Come I on. mean, he's not that bad of a summon. This is pretty neat. Those, those eyes were looking at you. Yep, they're weird. They're weird, man. I don't like it. And even creepier, those things have, like, just rows and rows of teeth on their head. Um, actually, do I want to check up first? You can do whatever you want, man. It's your playthrough. <laughs> You can do whatever you want, unless, of course, I want to lead you into a trap. In which case... Ah! <laughs> I was like, I can do whatever I want, eh? So I can spin around in circles like a ninny ninny poo poo? I mean, you could also do that. That, uh... People could start questioning you. I killed one of these before. I don't remember them hitting quite so hard. I mean, that was also, like, at the beginning of the game. I know. But, I mean, the Capper Demon didn't get any stronger since I fought it last. Yeah, but that doesn't drop upgrade material. Oh, yeah, good point. Does Solaire drop upgrade material? He drops his stuff. So I can dress like Solaire and be a Solaire head. That's what the people who like Solaire are called, right? Oh, and that thing stays there. Nice. Um, do I need to focus on killing those? No, just those? ignore those. Okay. Oh. Ah. Okay, but I'm... You should really... You know you can hit left and right to lock on other things. Left and right on the D-pad? No, just like when you're locked on, just flick to the left or right and it'll lock on other things. Okay. I assume I can parry him? Yeah, but not if you're dead. Ow, why is he hit so hard? It's like he's good at stuff. I mean, you do also keep healing, like, right in front of him, which... There you go. <laughs> Pyromancy! Dead! Uh, 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 Yay! Yeah. Uh, dark. So dark. Well, stop praising the sun so much. It's a sunlight talisman. Sunlight straight sword, sunlight shield. I'm seeing a theme here. It's as yep. if the sun itself is painted on a shield. Oh, and there's his armor. There you go. You could dress like Solaire now. What I what I want to though? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. I mean, if you're into that sort of thing. All right. I'm gonna hold this. Make sure nothing that never happens again. It will probably happen again. Hey, now you have one, so you can go cray cray. Does, does it make you go cray cray? 
No, you've already been here. Oh, this is just the other side of the room. Yep. Okay. So there's no reason to be here other than right. that. Right. The only reason you'd come down here is to try and finish the uh, his quest. Oh, okay. Because if you kill that thing before he comes down here, then he won't... Uh, it, you kind of save him, but you kind of don't, because, like, he, he would just go crazy and hollow anyways, because he would never find the sun that he's searching for. Huh. So it's kind of like a moral thing at that point. It's like, well, he's gone crazy, clearly, but he's happy. He's happy crazy. He's happy crazy. You want to poke him in the butt? Nope, he's just like, fuck that. <laughs> it's okay, I can run. And I ran. I ran so far away. I have no Estus left. No Estus night and day. Couldn't get away. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, hey, there's a thing over here. Oh! Oh, hey, it's the trap I was talking about. Hello, trap. But the sparkle. It's a trap! The sparkle was a trap. The sparkle was a trap. Sparkles can be traps. Sparkles can be traps. But that sparkle's not. And a trap, interestingly right? enough, traps can also sparkle. Um, Take that any way you like. <laughs> Take that however you like. All right, have fun. Oh, have fun down here. One of those things. Um, got a lot of souls too. You want to be closer, because it's just going to flash out before it gets to that thing. How do I get up there, though? Carefully. Very You carefully. have to go down to go up. That's dumb. This is a dumb thing. <laughs> Why am I playing this dumb game? Anyone who likes this game is dumb. James. Ow. Ow. Ow, my pride. Hey, you want to fall in the mouth? Not really. Does that sound like fun? Not particularly. Does that sound like a fun thing? There's more this way. There's also poison down there, so, uh... Yeah. So my lava boots aren't going to be particularly useful. Nope, not per lurk -ter -ker -ler -ker -ler. E. per la -ter -ker -ly. Oh, but hey, I could step on this, and then I can ride this up. See, look, you could go up to go down. Oh, okay. Um... I wonder where this will lead you. Wink. Oh, you fucked up. But now I can take this one over and not get over there. Correct. <laughs> but then I can go this other way and it'll lead me up there, surely. Surely it'll go up there. Or it'll just go back to where it was. Yeah, done. Fucked up. It's okay, I can get back on the one. Um... Not there. Now you really fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> now you really done goofed, kid. Like of all the of all the ways you could have done goofed, you you done you done goofed the most goofed. Like I, I don't think you could have goofed any more than you have just goofed. <laughs> <laughs> Why is there no crouch button? Damn it! <laughs> um. <laughs> Fuck! I like to point out I don't think I've ever actually gotten stuck back here like this, to where my only option is to fall. And you have no healing either. Oh, well, you're fucked. Now you're gonna get poisoned. And the water is very gushy and mushy, so you're probably gonna need the homeward bone before you die and lose all those souls. Oh, look, a happy thing. And you hit the wall. You should really homeward bone. Um. Okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> that is a thing I would like to do, thank you. And you know what, I think that's... An, I mean, I fought, like, how many bosses this session? Like, four? Five? Twenty? There, there were two. I mean, three, technically. I mean, if you count last this one, episode... This one episode had two, two bosses. Yeah, and I fought the one before that. So there's, there's three bosses. We made some progress. On an entirely new area. I think that's, that's good for now. Well, Good. we'll come back to this eventually, after we do some more Resident Evil. So it looks like it'll be nap time some other time. Yep, nap time, we'll have to wait until next time. 
he has no idea. You'll have to comment in the comments if you're excited to see the continuation of Dark Souls with nap times and stuff and thing and um, just just comment in the comments hashtag nap time is coming 2017. <laughs> Hopefully, <laughs> unless we don't get back to this at all. 2018. I swear, I hope will, not. Will I finish Dark Souls before <laughs> 2018? You'll have to comment that in the comments. I feel like I'm getting close. We are close. Hey. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Comment in the comments if you comment in the comments. Comment in the comments if you comment.